if you look at the number of Muslims who have won the Nobel Prize in the sciences, it's one. Number of Jews who have won the Nobel Prize? One fourth of all Nobel Prizes in science have been won by Jews. How many Muslims in the world? 1.3 billion. How many Jews in the world? 15 million tops. So you look at what effect the culture of discovery and learning can have on what you discover about the natural world. It's extraordinary. So just because you're making discoveries doesn't mean it's forever. And I look at the 20th century in America as a period of great discovery. And then I see forces now operating against it. And then I look at the history of the consequences of this, and I see America just simply fading into insignificance. No, it's not off of a cliff. It's just a slope. And every next day, you're a little bit further down on the slope. You barely notice it, right? Until one day you can't see over the hill that you just came from. And then you try to make do with what you have down here, and then you find out it's the rest of the world making the inventions 